What this allows you to do is search any keyword. It could be your niche, it could be a piece of content you're looking for, it could be a competitor's fan page, whatever you want. Let's type in something uh, like, actually I'll go down and select my account first. You can add multiple accounts to Instamate so you can manage multiple at the same time. So I'm gonna activate my personal account here, which is now simply activated. I'm gonna go into the Instagram finder. I'm then gonna post, I wanna find a motivational quote. Have a motivational quote and see what we get. So now it's gone and pulled every fan page that has to do with motivational quotes on Instagram and all of the hashtag pictures that have um, the word motivational quote hashtag to them. So you can see here for motivational quotes, there's uh, almost uh, just over three, uh, almost three quarters of a million pictures with that hashtag on it. But let's go here. We'll use this actual um, post here, uh, fan page here. Um, so let's find something that, something that I want to post to my account right now. Um, let's just go ahead. We can either download it directly to our desktop if we want to then repurpose this for Facebook or Instagram ads. Uh, it's perfectly sized for Instagram ads. We can then go ahead and actually upload this directly to our actual fan page. This actually pulls the content uh, caption that this photo had. Maybe I could do something here like if you're interested in more quotes, visit examplesite.com. So you're gonna add a call to action there or ask them to visit your website in your actual biography. So I'm gonna post that right now. Awesome, your image was uploaded successfully here. So I'm gonna hit okay. I'm gonna refresh this here to show you it's been posted. Now, that may, may seem simple if you've never actually seen Instagram before, but I can just imagine the people screaming and kicking around that actually can see it can be done from your actual computer here. So that's a massive thing there. And then if I wanna actually schedule it, I can go ahead right now, schedule wait, wait, wait. it. I don't, I don't wanna interrupt you, just real quick though, just so I'm clarifying here. Yeah. You can see Instagram on your on your website in your brow or on your browser on your computer, but you can't normally post to Instagram. No, you can't post to Instagram. That's how it works. Yeah, you can't post. You can't schedule. Wow, you can't. You can't That's edit the, images. They they kind of left out something there, didn't they? When they made Instagram, when you think about it, like it's like yes. Well, we'll let everybody see stuff on the computer, but we won't let anybody post from the computer. Exactly uh, right. What you're, what you're doing here is, just from what I can see right now so far, what you're doing basically is fixing Instagram. They have a problem, they left something out, and you're fixing that problem now. Exactly right. And it fixes a lot more pro problems than just posting it. Um, because we can use an actual uh, web-based software, our image, image editing tools and the things we can actually add into this suite itself, um, we can do a lot more here to actually just dominate any other Instagram account in the market. So this, in, its, in a sense, it'll let you see what your competitors are doing, find the most viral content, edit it to make it better, put your call to actions in, post and schedule your content for the next month so you don't even need to even log into your Instagram and it's gonna be pulling in leads daily. Um, I'll run over a few other little sections if you want me to here quickly. Um, unless you have any other questions right now, Brett. No, no, I, I actually noticed that you didn't, this last post that you had made, this demo, you didn't uh, schedule it, but I noticed there was two little boxes for it. Oh, yeah, let, let, let me show you how I'll schedule it right now. Let's just do an example. Let's go trending. This will show me what's trending right now um, on Instagram. So these are different trending photos. You can see how many likes and whatnot they have. Um, let's say I wanted to, to, to go ahead and schedule. Let's go this quote here. I'm going to go ahead hit upload, I'm gonna select a date, let's choose next, uh, today or tomorrow, 2, 2 a.m. So when I'm sleeping, I can have these Instagram uh, updates going out, which could be a prime time in another country and because I'm in Australia, it definitely will be because we have horrible time zones. Um, so I've hit schedule and we're gonna come over here, awesome, it's been scheduled, scheduled posts. And boom, there we go. So it's gonna get posted in 50 hours from now from the actual time zone that I set. Now again, you can do that for multiple accounts. It's not just one, it's actually multiple. Um, also I'll run over this one here, post Instagram. So say you have your own content on your computer, rather than finding other content and repurposing it, you can simply drag and drop your own here, add in your captions and whatnot, and it's as simple as that. Popular hashtags, so quickly about what hashtags are. 
it categorizes your images into a specific folder where other people can then come and see your content in that actual uh, category. So if I hashtag me playing tennis with the hashtag tennis, it's going to go into that category for the world to see. And you'll be surprised how much viral content, um, sorry, viral traffic you get from doing that. And you can add as many as you want. So we have a live list here of constantly updated hashtags that are trending. So for food, general desserts. So if I wanted to do a food blog, I could simply copy this. I could then go over here and let's type in food. Let's, let's click on a hashtag. So there's 183 million people have tagged the word food. It seems to be a very popular thing here. So let's <laughs> say I want to post this picture. They've already got a heap of different things here, but I'm going to paste my hashtags here. I'm going to go post. And now I'm going to be spamming all my Instagram friends with weird food pictures, but, you know, I'll sacrifice it for this demo. Um, so now I've got a strange piece of food there. So, um, But you guys get the idea. And you can build niche market actual fan pages with any niche whatsoever, find content instantly that's gone viral, post it and schedule it directly to your fan pages, um, and actually just sit back and watch your content go out, your engagement's happening. If you need to reply to comments and update things, and you can do it all from your computer itself here with Instamate, it's just, it's just the, oh, it saves that much time. We've also included a cool little Twitter trend section here, so we can actually go ahead and see what hashtags are trending on Twitter, jump over to the Instagram finder and find content in Instagram with these trending hashtags wherever you want in the world. So let's see what's happening um, here. I'm gonna randomly click here. Leaf Day Oscars, so I can find a picture of DiCaprio right now and post that into my actual feed, and I'm sure that'll get a lot of likes when I grab the right hashtags. So that's pretty cool. And then, um, so that's the basic insight of, Inst of Instamate here. If you want me to go into the image editors and whatnot, I can do that, but just, uh, just, just as a quick overview, it brings the top three uh, image editing tools that were on your phone to your actual, um, to this Instamate software here. So you can actually go ahead and make every piece of content you post unique. You can add your watermark to it. You can add your logo to any image that you upload into it. It's a one-click um, schedule and post directly from our image editor here. Uh, and what that does as well, people will often, Instagram's all about sharing the same content um, in viral niches. So when people then screenshot and share your post, if you have your watermark or logo on it, it's going to be actually driving traffic to you from other people posting your content for free. So that's a nice little cool add on there with the actual um, image editor down here.